Little wins, right? Yep. Like, I did, and there's Tom. In your play. Welcome to Retired Time Productions. So I'm going to be testing the new Easy UHF Nano Receiver. And I've got it on my Texumo wing here. And here it is right there. As you can see, it's kind of small. It's actually smaller than my flight controller board, the B-Rotor F3. Very small. And I've run the uh, cable for the antenna under here and then back up through the bottom to the top right there. So there it is. It may bend over if, it's, if it crashes, but it's flexible. You can bend it back. And I'm going to be using the Runcam Swift 2 camera with the uh, camera's OSD turned off because I've got my own OSD on the board here. And then I'm going to be using the Runcam 2 version 2 with a 170 degree field of view. So that's everything I got on there. Well, let's go out and see how this Easy UHF works. I'm not going to be doing long range with it, but I just want to see if it works at all. So the launch was a little shaky, but we got it up and it's flying smooth. Now if you look in the lower right hand corner, you will see the link quality for the Easy UHF Nano RX. And under that is the battery voltage and under that is the altitude. So enjoy the flight and I'll make some more comments at the end.
So the first test of the Easy UHF Nano RX went really well. I was able to fly further than I usually do out on the golf course. And what I was using was actually two monopole antennas right here. One came with the Easy UHF. This is just the standard one that comes in the package. And then the other one came with my Easy UHF JR module, which is on the back of my Tyrannus right here. So just using standard antennas, I had 100% link quality the whole time. No problem at all. The video did break up a few times. Uh, nothing big, didn't lose video altogether, but I noticed a couple little flickers. I am just using a V antenna here out on the end of the wing to my 400 milliwatt video transmitter. It's a 1.3 gigahertz and the receiver which is in my fat sharks, a 1.3 gigahertz receiver it's also immersion RC and I'm just using a rubber duck on that so even though I was just had standard antennas I thought it went really well and I enjoyed the flight. I hope you did too and thanks for watching. Keep your flight.